something else stood out for me. These attributes were common not just to the ancient mythologies, they were also common to Jesus. In fact, while all the gods of antiquity shared some of the same expectations of deity, only Jesus personified and embodied every expectation. It seems to me that there could be some selection bias here. He's taken these abstractions, he's understood them to be the part of a heroic cycle, and then he claims that these characteristics create expectations, and the expectations then are satisfied in Jesus. You'll notice that there's no critical perspective on who Jesus is, on differences in the Gospels. I don't think there's a single Gospel that has all of these characteristics. So this is a homogenizing of the biblical Jesus in order to make it fit all these categories.